Windows has come a long way over the years and so has customization. With Windows 11 you can make your setup look much cleaner, more professional and minimal without much effort. In this video I'll show you exactly how to get that clean aesthetic with a few simple tweaks that will turn your setup to something like this. Let's start with the desktop since it can easily get cluttered. You won't be seeing the recycling bin on your desktop again so I'd pin it to the start menu for quick access. Ok now you can right click on the desktop, go to view and uncheck show desktop icons. Instead you can access your apps via the windows search or the start menu. The default taskbar looks hideous. Let's start by right clicking on the taskbar to access the taskbar settings. You can hide the search box, switch off task view if that's on for you, turn off widgets and center align the taskbar. Ok this already looks much better. Now you can also choose to automatically hide the taskbar. Personally I don't recommend this. For example when I'm in apps like DaVinci Resolve I sometimes accidentally trigger the taskbar when I'm trying to switch the tabs. But if you want maximum screen space and a super minimal look it's definitely an option. What I would recommend is installing Translucent TB which will instantly elevate the look of your taskbar and blends in perfectly with a minimal setup. Just head over to the Microsoft Store, search for Translucent TB and install it. Once it's installed, open it up and it should automatically make your taskbar transparent. Don't forget to enable open app boot in settings so you don't have to launch the app manually every time you restart your PC. Ok this is where the real fun begins. You can stick with the default Windows 11 wallpapers, they're pretty clean and minimal but if you want something a bit more personal or dynamic, you've got two options, static or live wallpapers. For static wallpapers you can't go wrong with Google Images or sites like Wallhaven, Unsplash or Pexels. They've got high quality clean wallpapers that look great in any setup. If you're into live wallpapers however, there are two solid options. First up is Lively Wallpaper which is free to download on the Microsoft Store. It comes with a nice collection of built in live wallpapers and you can even import your own. But my personal favourite is Wallpaper Engine on Steam. It costs around 5 euros but for that price you can access hundreds of thousands of animated wallpapers. Plus the community is constantly adding more. I think this app is 100% worth the price. And for this video I'm using the minimalist Night Starry Lake wallpaper and you can already see how it pulls everything together. Just like Translucent TB, I recommend enabling automatic startup so you don't have to launch it every time your PC boots up. Now that the wallpaper is in place, let's bring the whole look together with some minimal widgets using Rainmeter. If you don't have Rainmeter, you can download it from their official site. I'll have the link in the description along with everything else mentioned in this video. Once Rainmeter is up and running, you'll see some default widgets on your desktop. You can unload these by right clicking on each one. Next we're going to install two skins from visualskins.com. The first one is Mond, it's great for a clean date and time widget. Just download it, open the file and hit install. Once it's loaded you can close the settings and unload some of the widgets. Personally I just want to show the date so I'll edit the clock.ini file and remove the date and time. Ok now that looks way clean already. I'm also going to scale up the text a bit in the clock.ini file and reposition it to where I want it. The second widget is called Monterey which gives you that Mac OS style widget panel. It looks super clean and doesn't bog down the performance. The install process is the same, just like Mont. I can toggle the widgets on and off and even change the appearance. I like to go with a blurred background to keep things subtle and soft looking. You can even change the size of these widgets so you can customize it to your liking. So this is what I've come up with. I've added a clock, notes, calendar and a music widget to complete the look. 